Go on, go on, go on. Do it. I do dare it. you. I dare you. I'll give you two dollars extra I'll, if you do I'll it. I'll be your best friend. Come on, more. I'm a little teapot. Dance, Rummy. Dance, perform. Here we are. Here's Saint Fletcher from YouTube. Better known as Fletcher without the Saint. But we like to call him Saint Fletcher. And we've got Luke. Embryonic 13. But you had a couple of other channels, didn't yeah, you? Yeah, I got Merrick's Rant, which is my rant channel, which I don't use as much anymore because I don't have a lot to put it because my video converter won't work. And I used to have Luke Gary 15. But Embryonic 13 is now my Luke Gary 15. Because I always knew he was Merrick. Yeah, so just call me Merrick. Is Merrick your real name or your surname no, or what? Merrick's my nickname. I've had that for a couple and of years. And where does it come from? I'm fascinated. Uh, some old, just some old English flash cartoon that's on the internet called Jerry Jackson. Oh, it's like, hello Merrick, can you come and play cars? No, I can't, i got to file my tax returns. <laughs> and of course, we both all do a channel called the Aussie Kings Cross the Night channel. That is What's true. happening with that? It's been a bit sort of dormant for a while, yeah, but I you, saw that. I you've made some, both of you made some excellent videos in the last yeah, week Yeah, I noticed straight. it was dormant when I got on there, so I'm like, alright, got to bring this back to life. And you did. I did. Both I of you. filmed a Trivium, I'm filming at my Zappatrix Experience performance. And I just basically put up a bunch of other things letting people know about stuff. And who was that awesome band you interviewed? Um, Power Age. They're going to be the next big thing. They are going to be the next big thing. And they play a lot of ACDC, Yeah, they were really they? nice guys in general. They've already played the footy show, um, World Cup prelimin preliminaries, and a bunch of other stuff. They've a rock concert in London. Yeah, they, they they've been to London. They've Global been to London. Battle of the Bands. Wow. And you interviewed them too, didn't you, Fletcher? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah story yeah, behind that. Oh, go story on. behind that. Okay, he said he was going to meet me there at about 9 at the Metro. I got there at 9, and I'm like, okay, he's not here. So I go interview the band and go home, and I get back to find out he's done the same thing. So he got there just after I did, so we got two interviews. That's so brilliant. And I heard both, and they were was, absolutely great. I was great. sick as a dog, and I wasn't going to go, and I was trying to email him on the, on the uh, YouTube. And I'd say, don't go, don't go, I'm sick, I'm sick, I'm sick. And because um, I, I thought he wouldn't have a camera. And then I, wor and I worked out that he wasn't catching the emails. I thought, I'd better go because I don't want him there by himself. Mm. So I went. <laughs> but it was, I went, it's late. <laughs> so, <laughs> it was, yeah, by default, yeah. we got two, two <laughs> interviews. And it was perfect. It came out really good. Because I wish I'd gone because I was in New Zealand. Yeah. And I had such a horrible time. The weather was crap. But I didn't do anything. And I should have just stayed in Sydney. And why am I filming myself? You're much better looking both of you. But um, yeah, so it was a bit of a non-event, my trip to New Zealand. Can you think, like, your next top, can you go to, like, New Caledonia or something? I want to go to Vanuatu. It was either Vanuatu or Auckland, and I think I chose the uh, short straw. Yeah, don't Vanuatu. Go, don't go to Fiji, where that's... Uh, boycott Fiji. Nobody go to Fiji. It's true. I did Fiji about four years ago, and all I remember is getting covered in mosquito bites. Yeah. They loved me. I made a lot of mosquitoes very happy. You've got lots of men with coconuts bashing... People. And you know what more? I've got a coconut allergy, so the coconuts and the mosquitoes, <laughs> it was a bit of a no-no. And I didn't even get to try any carver juice. You know the carver? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Still oh, not, never tried it. Most Pacific have that. But no, Fiji is, is, is run by a Mugabe type government, it and is. we won't go there. They've had a coup, Don't haven't they? They've had another coup recently, didn't they? Yeah. And those people on that PO no cruise who've got swine fever, that's that's karma. You should never go to Fiji and, and think you can thumb your nose at it because it's a, a dictatorship that we everybody said don't go to Fiji. What do they do? They go what go to this boat to Fiji and they go, oh, now we got swine flu it's because they were pigs and they set up going to Fiji even thinking about going there. Fletcher, you don't hold back with what you really think. Oh, no. <laughs> Blame the victim, that's what I said. You see, we, Mummy warned you not to go to Fiji, and you did, and look what happened. You get stranded on the boat between wherever it is, Brisbane or somewhere, and... The ship of death. The ship, ship of, of death. death. We've all got swine flu. We're having a lovely time here in Sydney, and they're stuck in a ship with all that food, with all that entertainment. Look, cruise ships look great, but um, being stuck on a ship for long lengths of time with the same bloody entertainers, cheesy shows is not my idea of a great holiday. And I've never been on a cruise, so boom. I've been cruising, but never on a cruise. It's, it's, and you're locked in with all of these old women, all sitting, I do like to be inside the seas. No, it's all right for five minutes, but when you're in there for days, you don't just want paracetamol, <laughs> you want heroin. <laughs> I'm not talking about heroin paracetamol, I'm talking about the other one. You want to be anywhere else but there. 
Um, but yeah, it's the ship of death, and Brisbane didn't want them. It scared the shit out of them. It was like five metres from the dock. What happens in Sydney if, if they won't let them in Sydney? They'll have to go back to Brisbane again. You know what I reckon? They should send them to Christmas Island, where they sent all the asylum seekers, and you'll have Christmas Island full of all these very rich tourists, Americans, Australians, and can you imagine? Christmas Island will become one of the wealthiest islands in the world. Well, let Fiji look after them. <laughs> Maybe they could have a coup, and Fiji will be full of all these multi-millionaires. But then, is it one of those expensive cruises, or one of those tacky cruises aimed at bogans? I don't yeah, know. No. It's, um, it's, a, it's a British ship, but um, I don't know. I mean, they employ Russian staff, usually. Communists. <laughs> They Communist. probably put it in the food. <laughs> yes, I think they should go to Fiji and um, they won't have their Mugabe government for long because they'll all have swine flu. It goes around islands. And, uh, yeah, yeah, that would be strategically really. Don't you think? I agree. He uh, I zoned out about halfway through, but I agree with you. Communism. <laughs> I think. Gotta love it. I think the whole of Sydney zoned out somewhere, but uh, that's a brilliant subject, isn't it? You've got to love it. Got to love placement, it. You can't sell communism, but we can sell capitalism. It works. The money. It's fabulous. <laughs> it's just the people it doesn't work for, that's all. <laughs> Anything both of you want to add? Oh, my sister, who was here about a second ago, who was sitting there. You saw her dancing at the beginning? Yes. Um, she's got a new show coming up called I'm Serious. And it's basically some small events, but it will always end in da 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 clap, or something like, I'm serious, and it goes to that, so... And what channel is that on? I love Prima J3. I love Prima J3. I'll spell it out for you. I-L-O-V-E-P-R-I-M-A-J-3. Watch it. I'll put links to all three channels on this video. And, of course, Aussie King's Cross tonight. And, of course, gotta get to that. It's not dormant anymore, so check it out. She's currently at the British Lolly Shop in King's Cross. Yes, the British Lolly Shop. For all your British needs. If I can't satisfy them, the shop may. Anyway, thanks for talking to me, guys. And I will definitely see you all again. Yeah, no worries. Have a great week. Let's see your little hand thing you do. Or as I do on my videos, take care of yourselves, stay safe. Bye for now. I did not steal that from Graham and Friends. <laughs> Oh, I love Graham with friends. I love him. I am going to rub his belly at the hey, Gold oh, Coast Gathering. I if I could go there, I would, but I ain't got the money. Although he has kind of suggested I rub more than the belly, but we won't go there. <laughs> Anything you want to uh, say goodbye, Fletcher? Oh, I just, I just got this picture in my mind. <laughs> Let's not go there. God bless you all, this team. <laughs> <laughs>